always knew we were a fairly odd family. Be prepared for strangeness. Get ready for spooky time. This really is my first film about family. It's as much to do with a brother and a sister and a father and a mother as it is to do with love. I resist calling them odd, because actually what they are is probably less odd than a lot of families. A lot of families are odd. Wow! I'm so good without the ball. <laughs> His father and him have a real kind of nice relationship. His mother's a little bit more strict, very supportive and all the rest of it, but uh, can be a little bit cutting and is a little bit strange. You were such an ugly baby. <laughs> I remember the first time I saw you, I thank God we were in driving distance of London Zoo. <laughs> His sister, uh, Kit Kat, who he's very, very close to, and they have a kind of a mad relationship because she's a little bit mad herself. Oh. Oh. Um, happy New Year, everybody. She really does seem to live moment to moment. She embraces things like nature and family and, and fun. I always thought of her as being, you know, Kathy or Kate Bush from Wuthering Heights, never wearing any shoes. And then in order to contrast most with her, this beloved uncle in his tweed suit and tie. He's probably on some level clever, but he's not very present. He sort of sits there and is constantly surprised by the world and by the fact that things are going on and has to be reminded of things. I've got an important announcement to make. We've decided, after a little bit of thought, to get married. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. That's wonderful news. Oh, Who are you getting married to? Oh. To Mary. Over there. Oh, thank yeah. God for that. <laughs> Jolly embarrassing if it had been another girl. Imagine that. <laughs> you can definitely see how close they are. You know, that, that would translate into him wanting that for himself. One of the things we deliberately did when we were making the movie is get the family to be friends. So we had a couple of days uh, where they just hung around together. And we kind of became a little family unit for a while. There was a huge amount of warmth on set. Lindsay and Bill were these, you know, as the parents, are just these amazing people. Every day they're on set, people are just happy that they're there. Because if either of those two people smiles, everybody feels a little bit better, you know, that sort of way. You do end up writing about subjects that intrigue you, and I've lost both my parents since I made my last movie, and so that issue of the quality of time spent with your parents has been very much on my mind. So it seems as though this issue that's so important to me in real life sort of crept in and infused the movie. We're all traveling through time together. Every day of our lives, all we can do is do our best to relish this remarkable ride.